I've been up so long. I've been up so long. I've been up so long. I'm afraid of coming down. Well, I woke up yesterday morning. Not much I was planning to do. And I got a call from a good friend. He said, let me come over there and have a little drink with you. Well, all right, I said, show me to lie in bed. Next thing I knew was the afternoon, all out of whiskey, nothing to do. I've been up so long, I've been up so long, I've been up so long, I'm afraid of coming down. Well, my friend said, we better get going to make it to the party cross town. I forget to mention the party With my good friend Cece In a nice royal crown Well alright oh, I, I walk but surely clear my head Next thing I knew was Midnight All out of whiskey And it does right I've been up so long I've been up so long I've been up so long I'm afraid of coming down Last drinks at the bar. Pretty soon they'll be closed. But don't you worry, we don't have to go too far. Well, all right, I said, show me it's going to bed. Next thing I knew was 4 a.m. and I'm feeling like a man about to be condemned. I've been up so long. I've been up. It's too late. Well, all right. I said, pretty sure soon I'll be dead. If I'm gonna crash through the bar, don't you know? I might as well have something that'll push and blow. I've been up so long. I've been up so long. I've been up so long. I'm afraid of coming down. I've been up so long. I'm afraid to come down mm. Woo! Hello Facebook people I haven't done one of these in a while So uh, good, to be, uh, good to be back on the interwebs um, So have a little sip mm. So that was a song about um, drinking whiskey Um so I think I should immediately follow it up, of course, with a song about drinking beer. And I, I um, wanted to do this tonight because I wanted to promote, for any of you who are in the, uh, the East GTA area in particular, um, doing a really special show on Sunday. I'm actually only playing for a relatively short time. But uh, the guy who is playing uh, after me, who I'm opening for, Tim Williams, is a fantastic uh Blues guitarist, I'm very, very proud to be, be opening the show. It's, it's quite, quite an honor, frankly. And um, I would uh, implore you, if you are at all a fan of great live music, great blues music, great acoustic music, to come to the Old Stone Cottage uh, this weekend, uh, Sunday. We're going to be uh, starting at 3 o'clock. I'm going to be on around 3. Tim's going to be on after me. He's going to do a bunch of just amazing, killer, 
acoustic blues, and I would highly recommend coming to that. $20 uh, gets you in. You can stick around for uh, for drinks and, and dinner and all that afterwards. Stone Cottage is a great place if you've never been there. We'll talk more about that in a minute. I want to do a song not about the beer at the Stone Cottage or, you know, most of the places that I'm likely to hang out these days, but from my past of hanging out in slightly sketchier places uh, from time to time, we would find that the beer was not so good and we would get the beer drinker's blues. <laughs> mentioned the old stone cottage sunday three o'clock um the stone cottage is a a tremendous venue and uh i am there often <laughs> perhaps more than a responsible uh adult uh parent should be uh but it's uh it's our local here in scarborough and uh there it's a great bar uh um we do our ukulele jam there every second monday so not this monday but it'll be the next monday so if you're all interested in that that's a little plug for the uh, the scarborough ukulele jam well we're checking out and, um, yeah, great place. We're, we're going to have, it's going to be upstairs in what we call the loft area. It's a really intimate, nice area. Uh, great for listening to music. We've had some terrific, um, terrific music there. Uh, Julian Taylor, uh, I got to open for, for Susie Vinnick a couple years back in that space. Um, uh, lots of great uh, talent that we've had up there. So it's well worth checking out if you've got 20 bucks and you got the afternoon free on Sunday. And you might hear me do... Let's see, maybe this song. Oh, you know what? I'll just do this. So, you may not know this. In, um, in, in the city of Scarborough, uh, going back many years, uh, before the City of Toronto Act, uh, there was a, a, a special law, a bylaw, uh, that if you operated as a one-man band within the limits of the old city of Scarborough, uh, you had a requirement, and this requirement has been now uh, incorporated into the rules for the city of Toronto, and the requirement is that you have to have a minimum one kazoo song. True story. So, per that, because it is the law, I have my one kazoo song that I'd like to do for you right now, and this is a song about growing up in East Scarborough, 
beside uh, beside the River Rouge. This is called River Rouge, and the subtitle is When I Die. <laughs> When I die, won't you take me to the river? Take me to the river where the water don't flow. When I die, won't you take me to the river? Take me to the river before they take me down below. When I die, won't you drink a little whiskey? Drink a little whiskey for your brother who is fast. When I die, won't you drink a little whiskey? Drink a little whiskey after I've drunk my last. When I die, won't you have a little party? Have a little party, won't you have it in my name? When I die, won't you have a little party? Brother, if you don't, cause I will surely do the same. When I die, I'm carrying my bones down to the valley where the rouge will be close. Well, little boy, he used to run away. Let the water carry him out to the lake. When I die, won't you take me to the river? before you're here. So, um, yeah, pimping out the old, uh, old Snow Cottage gig. Uh, check that out. Uh, you can check it out on my website, brokefuse.com. I will post a link to that in the little comment section of this. It's weird when you do these, uh, uh, I've done virtual concerts for many years now, some of you will know, in various forms. And it's always a little distracting because you're seeing yourself and you're seeing comments and you're seeing other things. So, uh, but anyway, uh, I'll post uh, um, some links and, and, and information in the comment section of this, uh, this video. Um, yeah, I'll do a couple more. This is... Um, uh, I'll do, uh, I'll do a, a Willie Dixon song, because you should do a Willie Dixon song. Uh, he wrote, he wrote uh, uh, many of the great blues songs, and many of them he actually got paid for. True story. So this is, uh, this is one of his best songs, I think. This is called 29 Ways. I got 29 ways to make it to my baby I got 29 ways to make it to my baby I got 29 ways to make it to my baby though. If she needs me back, I even got two or three
closet behind the clothes Where do the other that nobody knows That's the key to feeling in luck Hidden door behind the grandfather clock I got 29 ways to make it to my baby And if she needs a bed I even got two or three more There you go. All right. Do one more for you here. Oh. <sighs> you got the old rack there. Oh, I should point out. Oh, this is important. I almost forgot. I would be remiss. So, I'll do a little, um, do a little quick uh, plug here. Another plug. This is, this is nifty. Watch this. Okay. Let's zoom you in here. So, this, whoop, there we go. This is a little cool harmonica holder from um, a, a great organization called 3D Way. The 3D Way. I think it's the 3dway.ca. And the 3dway.ca is, in fact, my good friend, Mr. Bill Black, who uh, is one of our uh, participants at the Scarborough Uke Jam, uh, a great musician and a, uh, a 3D designer guy. And he put together a bunch of music accessories. So for those of you who are musicians, he's got a harmonica holder here, uh, I've got a, in another room, I got a, a little tray that you can stick on a mic stand and he's got a bunch of stuff. So it's, I th I'm pretty sure it's the 3dway.ca and I'm going to post a link to that too. And he's got, uh, so now I can get all my harmonicas and I can hang my little, uh, uh um, harmonica rack and I can do various things. And, and, uh, yeah, he's got a bunch of accessories for, for, uh, musicians. So very cool stuff. Anyway, I'll do, um, do one more here. This is, uh, so this is one of my favorites to, uh, to close with. This is, uh, my song about, uh. I like to like to say I like to sing the blues, but I don't like to have the blues, and it's, I'm lucky to have a great life. And this is a song about that. This is called Why Should I Be Blue. and toys Tell me mister Why should I be blue Listen up There ain't no point in going out of your way For reasons to be angry Each and every day This world might blow you a curve But you gotta keep on living what else you gonna do? Been down the road a time or two. If I had it all again, there's nothing I wouldn't do. Tell me, mister, why should I be blue? Why should I be blue? 
Why should I be blue? <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. The cat meowed. I don't know if that meant she liked it or not. Anyway, I think that's my cue. Thank you very much. Uh, once again, if you're around in the Scarborough area and you're free uh, and you have $20, come out uh, to this matinee show with uh, Tim Williams. It's going to be fantastic. And uh, hope to see you soon. Thanks.